Good evening and welcome to another edition of MWO Serial Reviews. I am your host, Bill Johnson, and tonight it's an interesting situation here. post Nilla Cereal Banana Pudding. Um, I believe this is based on vanilla wafers cookies, um, which I was never very fond of, but... For some reason, this intrigues me because I love banana, as everyone found out in the Frosted Flakes banana cream episode. And I see marshmallows happening here. Could be a good combination. I also look forward to trying some of these other cereals. I already did s'mores, which I loved. Can't wait for Nutter Butter, because I'm a huge peanut butter guy. Not a big Oreos cookie fan, but I will get to these eventually. I know a lot of people online have already reviewed them. It's not about that with me. It's just my personal checklist. Although I want to catch some of these before they disappear because I'm sure not all of them will be around forever. So let's open it up fresh. Let's take a sniff. Wow. So the banana is going strong. A lot like the banana cream frosted flakes. Smells like real banana. Let's go dry test. Wow. The bananas punched me in the face, and I like it. The discs are very reminiscent of Cookie Crisp. Exactly the same shape, consistency. The same crunch. Very promising dry test. There's a sweetness. There's a saltiness. There's banana, but not crazy fake banana. All right. Let's do the classic show off here. Look at that. Mmm, crunchy, crunchy marshmallows. Let's get it on. I'm excited, dry test has got me excited. So let's see what happens when we eat some of this with milk. Vanilla cereal banana plug. Not much happening here. Everybody knows I hate the boxes that just advertise me other cereals. Not very cool. But wow. I like this cereal. I like banana. Okay, so here's my issue with it. I'll go with that first. I'm getting punched in the face by banana, and I appreciate that effort. Um, the Frosted Flakes banana cream gave me banana, and it tasted like real banana. Once you really delve into this bowl, this banana is more like a uh, like a Laffy Taffy banana. It's closer to that. I'm not saying that it's bad. It's actually better dry. If you want to go dry snack, big time. But I'm going to go with an 8. I do like it. I will polish this box off. And I will, I might be a return customer on this. I'm not rock solid, 
if it was a little closer to the Frosted Flakes and I got the marshmallows going on to soften it out. I don't know, the banana flavor is just, and the more it sits with me, it's a little more fake tasting than the uh, Frosted Flakes banana cream. So that's that. And of course, you can never find banana as one of the uh, ingredients in a banana cereal. Why would that be a thing? So post Nilla cereal, banana pudding, it's an eight. If you don't like bananas, it's gonna be a one for you. Cause this is, this is banana central, punching you right in the, in the mouth hole. Click subscribe, notification bell down below, hashtag Marnie Z, Dear Darren Reviews, Cereal Time, Good Peeps. Have a good night. Love you guys.